Hi Mr Premier, this is Philip Malone of Noble Park. We've heard from you and Bronwyn Pike many times about how school closures are left to the school councils to make the decision. What we don't hear a lot about is how you threaten those councils with minimal to the minimal funding that you offer to schools and how you take away principals and threaten programs in order to get the schools that you have earmarked for closure to close. You don't do um, school uh, community meetings across all the schools, just the ones that you're looking to close. My question to you is this, why won't you and the government take ownership for school closures that you are choosing to close? The schools that you're handpicking to either put pressure on the councils or not. I, I agree with the policy of closing small schools to better distribute funds to schools that are of a proper size, but why can't you take the ownership instead of blaming school councils made up of parents and families trying to better the community? Thank you.